In this quick video here, I'm going to walk through um, adding JavaScript to a post or page in in WordPress. Okay, the first thing you want to do, um, if the if the Java code is part of an external file, what you would first want to do is um, add a an include statement similar to this in the theme. Um, of your WordPress installation. So the first thing you want to do is head over to Appearance and then Editor and locate either the header or the footer page from the sidebar here. Just click on that and then you can make modifications to it here. So you'll see here there's already a script. This one's used for the um, the category dropdown but this is where you would put the the actual this line here and then of course you're going to want to change the source value to be the actual location of the script file so first you want to upload the the JavaScript um, somewhere on your server and then point to it directly by changing the source here and then once you do that then you have access to the functions that are within this file um, within WordPress. And since you're adding this to the footer or to the header, then it'll be available to every single post and page. So after that's done, what you want to do is go, go to add new post, or of course that you can edit an existing post or even a page. And once you're in the editor, you change, you go from visual, you change it over to text. And then within here, you can actually um, put in HTML or JavaScript. So if you have a JavaScript command or function, all you got to do is paste it in here and of course call it whatever, like specifically. Um, as an example, in the theme here, this particular function is being used on every page. That's why it's, it exists in the uh, template. But if we wanted to run this script just from a particular post or page, then we would just that's what we would paste in here. And then after publishing or saving the post, um, this script will execute on that particular post. And that's all there is to it.